you thought Vikings and their berserkers had totally disappeared, then you clearly haven't met the incredible Ken Storns. If you've ever played God of War or watched the Vikings show on Netflix, this guy will look familiar. Halfway between Kratos and Ragnar, this 34-year-old Norwegian is a death-diving master. He loves the snow as much as torrents of icy water. And his experience will show you one thing. Living his life takes plenty of courage and a little bit of madness too. His thing is jumping from incredible heights to perform the most awesome tricks in order to cool off in fjord water along the way. In Norway they call it DDzing or simply eats. And this modern day Viking knows how to play that game better than anyone in the world. He even entered his name in the Guinness Book of Records in 2021. And when you consider how risky his discipline is, it commands respect. But to succeed, to overcome his fears, and become a de-deezing professional, Ken had to learn to push his limits and look death in the face. When he was in the army, That's right, before becoming a death diver and risking his neck jumping off the world's steepest cliffs, Ken spent a few years as an infantry soldier in the Norwegian army. Far less dangerous than death jumping, but it did teach him to train hard and forge a body made of steel. At the time, Ken hadn't yet mastered the art of cliff jumping. But he was just starting to take an interest in this ancient and ultra-popular sport in Norway. The first world championships he attended took place in 2008 and under very strict rules. Competitors were to jump from a height of 30 to 50 FT and hold a figure for as long as possible. And that's Ken's specialty. In other words, he could have won a lot of medals from the get-go. But here's the thing. Ken Storns isn't particularly fond of competing. Only Thor can judge him. But still, he didn't get a world championship title. But Ken became a legend in August 2021 by jumping from a 100 FT cliff near Oslo. He set a new world record for death jumping. A jump as high as a 10-story building. Sounds crazy, but for Ken, it's part of his daily routine. However, on that day, he managed to beat the record of the two-time world champion Emil Liebeck. An exceptional performance, but he wasn't alone. He was also surrounded by seven people, a crew in charge of checking all different kinds of safety measures, which allowed Ken to solely focus on his legendary jump. Yes, death jumping is far from being a sport you practice alone. Unfortunately for Ken, two other hotheads also ride their luck in the same spot. His compatriot Torvage and Frenchman come Girardo. But to claim it back, Ken has promised to fight to the bitter end. And we don't really feel like finding ourselves in a 1v1 battle against him. Because once again, Ken Storns has been blessed by the gods. With his berserker physique and his uncommon determination to win, he's had to put his warrior skills to the test for real. And the timing was perfect, because Ken Storns is also a formidable MMA fighter. In April 2018, he finished second in the ADCC Open in Oslo. During the competition, Ken defeated Marcin Ostolski on points and Alexander Halifors before being submitted by the mighty Jonas Kiernan. With two wins from three matches, 
Ken Storns gave his team Victus a fine silver medal. Above all, he impressed everyone with his stamina and his warrior mentality. Of course, fighting Ken Storms is like hitting an iceberg. But if you think about it, Ken comes from the cold. He was born in the small town of Hallstad in northern Norway, a city with some of the most extreme weather conditions. And when you spend your time diving into frozen water or swimming under the ice, there's nothing to be afraid of. By dint of training in a freezing cold climate and hostile environment, Ken has almost gone back to primal living. Ever since he was a child, he's been in total communion with the elements, just like his glorious ancestors were once upon a time. Above all, he knows the forest like the back of his hand. That's right. When you jump in tight gaps, it's best if you know where you're stepping. Before you follow Ken on his adventures and start being in perfect harmony with nature too, you've got to know the dangers it implies. And for that, you can fully trust this D-Hard adventurer. If you ever find yourself hiking in the forests of northern Norway, you might come across Ken and his dogs, out for a stroll or in the midst of a death dive exercise. It's no surprise to see Ken Storm's videos and his atypical lifestyle being so popular on social media. More than 200k people are following his superhuman achievements and his refreshing saga on Instagram. If Marvel is looking for a new teammate to fill the role of Thor, they can always rely on the incredible Ken Storms.